Camino. These guys competed, competed for so many years, and that guy as well, and that guy as well.
Yes! Woo! All time Super Bowl champion! Yeah! Yeah! We have many of them here today. Thank you. Um, we're here tonight as we come um, not only to acknowledge, celebrate this wonderful founder, these treasures of seven inductees, um, icons and heroes from uh, Pacifica of oh, our wonderful game, this game we love so much. And I'm just privileged um, to be part of this. It's a perfect, perfect city. Um, look, we're here. Um, and, and the Garden of Eden, I get so excited when I see the field. And at Eden Park, um, the, the field of dreams. Yes. Um, and it is a spiritual, the spiritual home of, of rugby, I believe. And the uh, biggest, us the biggest city in the world. I'm going to give my photo open. Can we give ourselves a hand? We're doing this right here. And, um, Yes. Um, there's some amazing things we're doing. Um, out of that, out of our own, um, thank, well, you. thank you, man. 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 Thank but, you know, just as we're celebrating uh, Pacific excellence, uh, we're also celebrating our contribution and our influence on this great game of rugby. Um, you know, as we do that, and I do want to say, it's also a celebration of, um, I suppose it's the gift of rugby, um, you know, to transform, to empower, and to unify. And I don't know, but I feel that my father, Mr. I told my father, I feel in my heart, it's deep in my heart, I've been talking to people, they can feel the love and the aroha, the offer, a my and it's, and it's, it's powerful. And so we, 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 we come together around that beautiful notion of our hearts are born, our hearts are full of gratitude, and our hearts are humble. Yes, we're going to work so we're going to party. What amazing music can we give up for our people? <laughs> 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 Um, she's the most famous whistle for that in the house, I can assure you. <laughs> we love her so much. Um, you know, having the Prime Minister, the uh, Prime Minister, uh, Chris Malaxon, your, your presence here. Thank you. Um, yes. What it does, what it does, I'm just going to read out. So we believe this is an important buggy, uh, but you've been here, uh, Minister Ritty. Um, and on, a, on a happy occasion, because we were back here last week supporting the Crusaders, I know you were very sad. <laughs> Our beautiful boys over there, thank you. <laughs> oh, nice, here in the park. You can still become a member of Pokemon Pacific Art and the Blues. Our <laughs> CEO, Billy, over there, the editor over there, and you can sign up and join the paper. You're, you're coming on board. Um, you know, it just as we acknowledge you and, you know, we acknowledge, uh, I suppose, other leaders, not just politically, from every uh, aspect and every dimension of our Pacific leadership, I'm just overcome. Uh, there are so many political people. I do want to acknowledge our uh, U.S. Uh, Country General, um, uh, Sarah Nelson. Uh, I know the only reason we came is because you're a Jesse South Wind fan, and you're a Supreme Army fan. And uh, you probably would have come, of course, if like this young man, you would have come. The, the, we do also have uh, the, the, the Barbara elements, honorable Barbara elements. You know, we're so grateful with this. You know, Karma couldn't make it, so I think she was um, running up like the cemetery doing a training, and she did her pain, like, give you some, you know, the excellence. You, Karma, uh, and our Pasifika MPs, um, particularly our Karma, 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 you inspire us, you know, you guys have um, really been 
the inspiration behind generations to come as well. Thank you. I'm also, and I can't believe that, I, I, I know my dear brother put the funeral film of the Cook Islands, um, it's YouTube, and I know there's others in the room, and I just don't want to make that matter. I'm so happy to see you. He's also the president of the Cook Island Working Club, so go figure. That's how we roll in the Pacific. <laughs> I do want to acknowledge um, the Cook Islands 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 Cook and um, your team out there, Mark, um, you know, just thank you for being here in the You know, you're a good partner, and you believe in the city of excellence, and you thank you for your fears and for the scope of the reason why I was free. And also, I'm just going to allow you to appreciate it for me, and for our room. Thank you so much, and uh, we appreciate your struggles for today, and that we've got to keep the fight. And we keep fighting the good fight, and that's what it's about. We honor you all. Um, this is my name. And uh, we are really going to try and make it. And this is going to be very fun. It's going to be very fun. And it's certainly on our way. We're following our bridges and our matches in the room. The fish is here, the water is here, the rose is here. But that's what it's about. The music is going to be a little bit um, it's a bit of a across our game. And I'm also the kind of thing, uh, old boys, can we give it up for our own people? We really need to to be stakeholders of this because this is all about putting and supporting what your given blood students is for. This is all about also the information that, that we're very active given now. I don't have a question thing for you, but that's best advice. <laughs> it was running through the South Africans, I can still see the brand new black and white footage. So I see them and then you had the audacity, the Samoan audacity, or could have been the Kukana audacity, to go around the, the dead wall and fight step and fight the dead wall. You love that, especially back in the air, the seminars. You know what they did? They captured an imagination of a generation. I was one of those young boys growing up in West Auckland. And I, I really started to believe that I could do it. And Sir Reggie was my hero, my role model. If he could do it, He's one of us. There was not many of our brown faces anywhere, and I could do it. So I know he's going to make a from Henson. And so I acknowledge and honor this man because if it wasn't for that inspiration, which is what this is all about, the inspiration, I would have been standing here today and ever been an old man. I would never have been able to pursue my dreams, my, what I wanted to do, if it wasn't for those trailblazers that did a good job before me. Since then, there's been a proliferation, an explosion. Of Pacific Island Impacts and Black Burns representing political teams in black. And we honor our Black Burns tonight. We have so many of them here. Too many to name. I'm not sure Black Burns. <laughs> and, um, and so I'm sure I could say, I always feel good. The rounds of the game, particularly in, the, in here in Aotearoa, but at Wood Rugby, that struggle does continue. History um, that speaks to our migration <laughs> story. As Pacific people and finding our place in New Zealand, our sense of belonging, shaping our unique identity here in Aotearoa. And over the last 40 years, in particular, we have been turned and enriched the game, enhanced our influence in the game of rugby and our DNA throughout the Pacific and the world. So tonight, we celebrate that legacy and contribution of our yes. Pacific players to our beloved game throughout the world and the legacy of that game. For generations to come. And I acknowledge uh, we have some of our most recent old backs. Caleb Clark is here, of course, my yes. and I'm sure that a couple of others out here from this generation are just very proud of us. Such an impact. And we're going to hear a bit more about them. Such esteem, such manner, such influence. They all, as you will find out, or you will read, have been already inducted into the World Rugby Hall of Fame. And so that was an important criteria for us for our first inaugural uh, celebration, first inaugural acknowledgement of our Pacific heroes. What we're doing tonight, everyone, is honoring those specific heroes that have already been inducted into the World Rugby Hall of Fame. Isn't that awesome? But tonight, if you'd like to come home to the people and be inducted into the Pacific Rugby Hall of Fame. Awesome. <laughs> People are 
to celebrate. Um, what, that's what we're doing tonight. It's all about that. How do we do that well with excellence, our rich culture, our music, our identity, and to share that with the world, not just our world here, but the wider world. To connect. When we look at what's happening in Australia, we were talking about that with the Prime Minister. More of our people are setting up a home there, finding place and identity there. And they too are having a huge influence and contributing increasingly to the game in Australia. What a day it was of immense pride when two a New Zealand Samoan and a Wallaby Australian Samoan captain uh, Australian Wallabies and All Blacks last year in a, in a Minnesota Cup. Isn't that awesome? Yeah. Let's go. I'm just not sure. I'm 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 not sure. Think of the two Rocky Rocky Dynasty. If you can, it's scary. But it's a thing and it's real. You know, Manu, played for England. The four brothers, Matalea, um, uh, Fred, Henry, the, the French women's team. Uh, they came out and met the Black Rings last year. And they're celebrating here because that's also something to celebrate. The new French Polynesian Pacific powerhouse that's taking over Europe. And, and probably we need to go and get some uh, players from New Caledonia and lots of the Punama. Uh, <laughs> Who knows? But also we have tonight Arsene uh, Naupu. Uh, who was the captain of the Irish team? Yeah. Uh, certainly, professionalism has afforded Pacific Island players, particularly for Fiji, Tom, and South Wales. The other teams at the Rugby World Cup last year, um, half the teams at the Rugby World Cup last year had Pacific players in it. Isn't that cool? Another bust and bust for that. <laughs> it's all about the Pacific Rugby Hall of Fame has a global reach and footprint, as I mentioned, with our board all over the world. And our heart is, and we're an autonomous, independent, beautiful, and platform. Please know that. We're not aligned with any rugby union, any franchise. We are fully independent. Yes. And to that, we, we, we feel we can provide a, 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 an important vehicle and means to unite the global family. And as I said, how does that collective authority and influence? The thing is a platform to champion and use our collective influence to make a difference in our game um, and to identify issues, causes, challenges, initiatives that we believe in and we can spearhead or support all of our pain. Um, can we please give a round of Thank you. 
this for our game and continue to do it. And it is in the sort of we'll be more about that. But both of you and all of you families we need here tonight. It's the ultimate blessing. I've played Selena. Thank you so much. <laughs> and of this Waka, and we're sitting out for New Horizon, and we appreciate your continued goodwill, love, our fun and support as we journey together. Tato, Tato. Enjoy the evening. Thank you. It is a privilege to be here with you tonight. Yes. I am joined by Connie in Football Hall of Fame, co-founder and vice chairman, Mahatan Rasa. Mahatan is a two-time Super Bowl champion Woo. and a 2017 Eagle team for the Bowling Football Hall of Fame. Now, in our culture, our Pacifica culture, but so is easy. Right? 
right, so can I go into the zoo? My mother always sees me. I'm not going to accuse me, she's here tonight. I need my own. <laughs> she would say something like, uh, I'm not mocking me, I need to make that out. Actually, waste of food, I'm going to have to break this. Let the balance here. We'll be back shortly. Yes. Guys, we want to show you appreciation for your remarkable contributions to this sport. First up, it's on a religion whose influence on the game extends far and beyond the field. A true icon. Of New Zealand rugby. He was a luxurious career as a player and a coach. His contributions to the sport are unparalleled. Let's give a warm welcome and a round of applause for Sir Brian George Williams. Yes! Inspiration, I guess, that we all receive 
not not only a rugby, but in, in life in general. So thank you very much, and uh, um, enjoy the rest of the evening. Thank you.
It's a Pacifica, first a historic Pacifica rugby ball of fame award. And I have to do this. And let me say, all the players, our Pacifica players, please be told us somewhere, all over the Pacific, that we represent that we are all here to celebrate. And I want to say thank you so much for the opportunity. I'm standing here and I want to say thank you to all the coaches that are played with. Without those coaches, I wouldn't be here. And all the players that are played with, without all those players, I wouldn't be here too. And the most importantly, all the players that are here, that are played against, that have been chasing me all around. <laughs> Salute to your old family city house in Samoa and has been a dynamic force in New Zealand and international rugby, having carved her path to rugby starting from sheer determination and impressive talent. She made 106 appearances for Auckland and 57 for the Black Ferns, a team she captained from 2012 nice. to 2018. Renowned for her leadership and expertise in the scrum, she played a pivotal role in multiple Women's Rugby World Cup trials, becoming a symbol of excellence in the sport. Off the field, Sayuri continues to make waves breaking barriers by becoming the first female president of Auckland Rugby. Woo! She Let's was go. inducted two. into the World Rugby Hall of Fame during the 2021 Women's Rugby World Cup, making history as the first woman of Pacifica descent to receive a prestigious honour. She stands as a trailblazer in the youngest of the six legendary players for the Yeah! And that is 
something we're celebrating, and I'll be supporting every step of the way. Thank you once again for this honor. Okay, sorry, Rabba, I'm not, but I'm not going to get that to the <laughs> well, like, I mean, I've just been starstruck. So, I mean, a lot of the legends and the icons that I've looked up to as a kid, but it's just all here in the room, and it's uh, just special to be celebrating such great ambition and aspiration and excellence. And the talent in the Pacifica community is immense, and it's not just in rugby, it's across everything. We need to see all of this community step up and take on positions across the whole of the country, and I think uh, we'd be a better country for it. So, um, you know, it's been a real pleasure to be here for a great couple months. So, really special. Exactly. I noticed that I mentioned about the Auckland Blues. I keep hearing Auckland Blues, Auckland Blues, but there's another blue team on the South Island. Do you know that team? Yeah, yeah, um, the Crusaders. No, the Hunt was the Hunt. So look, we're just going to have a for audience and participation. So I'm going to get you to get involved. So this is the many, many nuts. So you know the many things just put in there. So everyone ready? Everyone stand up because you've been sitting down a long time. Get two kids. Okay, ready? <laughs> this guy was a beast. <laughs> and um, yeah, it, my, my upbringing was very much in the, the Tongan culture. Um, although 
although my name is an English name, it, looks, yeah, it doesn't really resonate. But, uh, it, 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 my, my heritage has always been, um, and, and my family has always been in Tonga culture and, and the Pacific culture. Um, it, it's important for me that I do recognise the past Pacific players uh, within Australia, um, or who, who played rugby and forged a path, pathway for myself. Billy Ami Ofenale was a yes. hero of mine growing up. Really um, old. Growing up in the Manly area, he was a hero of mine. Um, I was a hero of mine. Um, uh, Billy Finale, Okulina Peniketra, and a family manu, and a person I'm holding reverence uh, for what I care for these people. Um, of course, apart from me, you might have just talked about Carolinas. These guys are the, are the, the people in this inspiration that have forged a for me. But being uh, now we, we have within Australia, you know, first generation parents who are producing some, some beautiful players who can play the, the game in, in the right spirit. Um, some often translate that our captain Earl at all in, in, in World Cup this year with Davis Sevilla. You know, to, to have uh, two Polynesians um, captaining two, two great nations in all places in the world. Um, thank you very much. Uh, I'm very humbled to be here this evening to share with, with you all, um, and uh, and we look forward to seeing how that ends up for you. So thank you very much. Everybody. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my absolute pleasure to introduce our next uh, inductee, Muyate Brian.
in an iron aluminum from a 245 ton throughout my journey, not only as a player, but currently as a national servant's coach. I also want to thank the people behind this great Pacifica Hall of Fame University platform not only acknowledge the chance to have created youth in that on this talent, but also an opportunity to inspire our brothers and sisters in rugby fraternity. May our God bless us all. So it's for my young and real.
As we honor Joe's unparalleled legacy, we extend our deepest gratitude to his family, Nadine, and sons for their unwavering support and sharing that his legacy endures for generations to come. Thank each of you for the support and the love that has been shown to us, the children and I, since losing Jonah and the difficulties that we have faced, the difficulties that we continue to face. But something that Jonah said to me the day before he passed away was promise me. Promise me you will never give up. Promise me you will never stop fighting. No matter how hard it gets, no matter who you come up against, but promise me you will keep going. To continue on his legacy, for the grace and good of our people, but for his children as well. So I thank you from the bottom of my heart. I thank everybody that has shown support to the children and I. And lastly, and 